Tonight on our Great American panel, he was a former pollster for President Jimmy Carter and an advisor to George McGovern's presidential campaign. Fox News contributor Pat Cadell is here. He was a former mayor of Providence, Rhode Island, who currently hosts his own radio program, The Buddy Cianci Show. And he's also the author of Politics and Pasta, two of my favorite things. Yeah. Vincent Buddy Cianci joins us. And she is the director of the Lawfare Project and the author of Lawfare, The War Against Free Speech. Brooke Goldstein also joins us. Great to see you guys on a Friday night. Well, Bachman surprised me. She's, she's been consistent and she's, uh, she's a lot better than a lot of people think. And she's from Iowa. I don't know if she's got the ground game. I don't know if she's got the money. Oh. But the fact of the matter is she did a lot better than I thought. But I think Gingrich, it's, it's Gingrich is to lose at this point. Well, Go ahead, Pat. Look, let, let me just say this. First of all, I want to say something about what Brooks said. I was so glad to see them talk about foreign policy because I've been doing polling on it. It's such a gigantic issue. And no one in Washington, the Republican Party, thinks to think, seems to think it matters. And it matters a great deal. And people feel very strongly, particularly about Muslim, Islamic terrorists and about Iran. Uh, I want to say this is a race down to two people. It is about Newt Gingrich and, 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 and Romney. I thought they both had good debates. Gingrich had a tough moment on the, on the Freddie Mac. And it's hurting. You know, this question is very simple. And by the way, if we're going to discuss Fannie and Freddie, let's discuss the fact that we have a chief of staff in the White House and the head of national security. Both should be in jail over that issue. But anyway, the, the, the media should get this. But look, you, the, here's the choice Republican voters are struggling with. The first thing is, are they going to go with Romney and is he Nixon in 68, steady but can win, or is he Dole? And are they going to go with Gingrich and is he Goldwater, or is it Reagan kind of election? Let me tell you something. Gingrich's election, the fact that he's in this race, is about the moment right now that this country is out of the box. 69% of the people think it's in decline. This isn't conventional politics the way Washington and the media discuss it. How, how, can, how can there even be a question? that Obama is like so even and ahead when this country has, as you say, what's really 70% of the people think the country's going in the wrong direction. 50